Hello guys, I uh, hope hope you guys are all doing well. Sorry for being a bit late. I'm uh, 10, 10 minutes late, so very sorry about that. You guys just popped into the stream. I hope you guys are all doing well. Let's just load this up on my end. Today we'll be going through the second episode, which is out out of time. Um, so I hope you guys are all doing well. Post, post, post in the chat if you're just in the stream. I'd love to see some new faces. Open up there, and I can see it all on my end. Just making sure I can see everything on my end. Let's right. make sure I've got it all up on my end, guys. Very sorry. Um, just make sure I've got it all loaded so I can see. Put on mute. There we go. Okay. We're all good to go. So if you haven't seen the first one already, I streamed this one Monday. Um, and then uh, the other day, um, I did all the collectibles. So I think it's 10 trophies per each one. So I went and did that. So I've got all, I've got all the trophies for that. Um, so I, I won't focus on the trophies when I'm on stream, but I'll focus on it when like, I'm off it. So it's not too bad. So if you ain't seen the first one, definitely go and check that one out. If if you haven't already and let's jump straight into the second one um, and if you're in the stream just let me know what the sound is like if it's good on your end just so I know how it sounds and that but let's jump straight into the second episode <laughs> this is one of my favourites. The songs in this game are really good. If you are in the stream, though, definitely drop a chat in the stream. I'd love to uh, talk to you. Oh, um, I forgot what this one's called. Lots of good songs in this game. Something good. That's it. Let's turn it up a bit. Let's go. Oh, the songs are so good on this game. Really good. Fucking love them, man. Being a superhero is dirty work. <laughs> I need a shower. It fucking looks it. Mrs. Hoida is still out sick. <laughs> I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. It goes into the mental health stuff. Me? Oh, it's got a message from Chloe. Got a bell, uh, breakfast is go, you there Max, like I said, always uh, for you, no emoji. <laughs> While my guitar gently sleeps. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me in the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. It'll be fun to get some peeps together and play a real game instead of drama games. What's the charge I've got my laptop? Pretty good charge, and oh, that's fine. 
If you are in the stream, uh, just drop a comment in the stream what you are all up to today. I'd love to hear what you guys are all up to. And if if there's any new people that are n new into the stream, definitely now drop a comment what games you play. Films are based on a true story. Hmm. Interesting. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. This plant. Drink up. It's got electrolytes. This action will have consequences. Oh, that's not good. Good morning, Lisa. Your leaves are lovely today. I may not have a green thumb, but I have a green finger. Let's see what's on the laptop. Warren is blowing up my inbox now. As long as he helps me figure this out. This is so insane, it sounds logical to me. This wormhole thing makes total sense, but doesn't explain how I can do what no scientist ever has. I would say this is some crazy shit, but now I'm not so certain. Should I sign? And I thought I was into Halloween. <laughs> Dana is not messing around here. I like it. Dana, she's got a good character. It's really annoying how it keeps drifting. I'm going to have to have a look at that. No smiling. Take your power seriously. <laughs> this picture will capture this crazy historic moment in my life. I could rewind for days <laughs> and read all of these books. Will I really find any insight into my power? Most, most I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. I don't think there's anything else in this room, really. Um. Cartier, Bresson, Doino, Hamilton, the greatest. Oh, it keeps drifting. That shit, that shit really annoys me. I am so not a rebel. Well, I, I always like my bed to be I have to look tight. at getting another controller. Thank you. The Max it'll, Caulfield it'll, Photo it'll Memorial now. Wall. What did she say? Um... Okay, Max, let's hit the showers now. Where is the showers? Courtney, seriously, do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I am so on it. Consider it done. Hmm. She, she's nice. Mm -hmm. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? No brook here. Yeah, we're definitely not knocking on Victoria's door. Can't stand uh, Victoria. Oh, what about Kate? Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. <laughs> Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Your action will have consequences. How can telling someone to move out of the way have a consequence? A bit weird, but okay. Gross. The Vortex Club are such pigs. I'm glad I pissed them off. Wake up, Max. I think Juliet is next to me in the hall, not oh. her room. <laughs> We My should be watching this. Everybody's seen it by now. Who's in this one? Red Drop. Clearly not a morning person. Oh, hello, Brooke. Hey, Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. Um. Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. 
Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? Um... I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll <laughs> see you around. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? That's so not cool. I didn't get wasted on camera and get busy with the Vortex Club. Kate's not like that, what and you awesome. know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touche. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing yet. My mind works in devious ways, too. Glad to see you back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. Oh, hello, Dana? That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Best time of the year. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. Hmm. Speaking of Halloween, look at all this makeup. <laughs> at least Dana knows how to use it. I'm assuming they're sunk in this room that you got her. Who will survive and what will be left of them? Don't say that out loud, dork. It would be fun to put skulls and ghosts all over Blackwell. Like I could pull this look off. <laughs> Hello, Victoria. Let's talk to Dana. Hello, Dana. Hi, Dana. How are you? Much better than yesterday. I'm glad we talked. Me too. I know it's good to just talk about this stuff. You're almost psychic. I felt like you knew everything anyway. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor <laughs> asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Mm. Why not? Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. There's nothing else to look for in here, is there? Dana takes her Blackwell spirit seriously. That's what I mean, it keeps dragging. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should uh, write this so you might not hate my dumb ass forever. I know I act like a tough joker around you, but I never had to act around you. Not the kind of man you deserve. You, should, you saw how I pussed out. If you need any money, let me know. Give sense the person that knocked on the door. What's up, Josh? Um, hope things are good, mate. And if a user currently watching the stream, thank you very much for dropping by, as it really does help me. And I hope you guys all enjoy the stream. Right, I knocked on her door already. She was not happy. Now, let's go to the showers. Is it in this bit? Suck it, I hope not. I'm sure I'm going to miss some bits. Should be fine. Glad Thanks for the warning. Right. Oh, this is... Yeah. There's Kate. The way they pick on Kate is not cool. Otter power? <clears throat> I'm so not there. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Right, let's, look, let's talk to Kate. 
Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Yeah, and like, I, I love Kate. Like, she was, she was great. Can't pick between her and Chloe. Yeah, same. What's up, Kate? School. That's it. I can't stand her. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. <laughs> Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Reach it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. Isn't we ran all nice? the way. Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. <laughs> you can hang out with Kate. Or Max. <laughs> oh. She's nice. She's a very nice person. Definitely She's a weirdo snob. with that dumb camera. <laughs> I hate that I'm so quirky crap. <laughs> anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. <laughs> what an awesome. <clears throat> Victoria's so ugly though. Yeah, mate, on the inside the and on the outside. Well. Is that the link to Kate's video? Damn, Victoria is so fucking mean. You would definitely wipe it now. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. It's actually worth consequences. Well, fuck it. Hello, water. Oops. Sorry, <laughs> I forgot. No, you can't go in there. Is that it? Oh, it's nice. Rachel is a whore. I wonder who wrote that. But yeah, guys, this is, uh, I think, this is my second time going through this game. So I, I know basically what happens through most of it. So I, I won't um, say what happens if that you haven't uh, played the game. But um, if you have any questions about the game, Definitely drop it in the comments um, and uh, be happy to talk about the game itself. I assume we've got to go back to our dorm, right? Mm. Where is our dorm? Ah, oh, that's Kate's room. Juliet's, that's Dana's, what's that? Stop, stop on Bigfoot's, that's Brooks, Stella's, 
No, no, so we've probably gone the fucking wrong way. Leave the guild, uh, the girls' dorms hall, can't we? Ain't even got ready yet. Okay, time to get dressed for the day. Yep, yeah, I'm working on that, just trying to find the room. Oh, that's Victoria's, don't want to go near her. There we go. We got there in the end, guys. No fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. Yeah, you can tell that was uh, Victoria. No book here. Let's have a look around. Of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. Better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. All right. Let's just move. Be gone, foul soft drink. Move that first. And Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Got that pretty fast. Now we just need to get ready. There's nothing else around here, is there? Nah. No. Knowing me, I'm always going to miss something. You always do in games like this. Oh shit. Nathan's revenge. Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. Man, this could almost be art if it wasn't so fucking sick and disturbed. There's nothing you can do about that though, is there? Uh, put away. There you go. So far, we ain't got no trophies yet, but get dressed. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. But yeah, if uh, you if you have played any now, I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. So yeah, As if, if I have to worry about being late anymore. If you have played all of all the games, the the um, what's your favourite? Um, of the Life is Strange games. Mine's between this and the newest one. Oh, private number. Listen, yep, yeah, keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your arse. I know where you sleep. Oh, that's nice. Even with all... That's nice, isn't it? That's so, so nice. All this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Like no time has passed. Right, where's Kate's dorm? I'll go past it. That's Stella's. Taylor. No, me, I probably went past it. Kate, here you go. Kate, you in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Matt. Uh, she looks sad and depressed. Kate is all alone dealing with this video yeah. bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. Shit. Kate, your father and I just received a rather disturbing call from the prin Principal Wells about you and some party video. Mm -hmm. Our concerns about sending you to Blackwell seem justified. Please call us after your classes uh, so we can fully discuss this matter. We hope you haven't brought shame on you oh, or your family. We'll pray for you and expect you to pray for forgiveness. Oh, mother's a bitch. Oh, what the fuck, man? Kate used to play the violin every morning. <laughs> she stopped last week. No. Oh. Kate's art is perfect <laughs> for a children's book. Everything looks so fun and colorful and positive. Mm -hmm. And they fucking took that away from her by doing that stupid shit. That's a lot of tears. Mm -hmm. She's going to go through boxes. Kate really has a doting father. Mm -hmm. And the light shines in darkness and the darkness comprehend it not. John 1-5. Kate... Uh, you'll always be my brightest light. Um, 
against the dark. Well, at least her dad has a heart for her, unlike her mother. I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Did not know that. Oh, got a rabbit. Oh, this that is, is the cutest bunny This would be the ever. first trophy, actually. I bet Kate is a good mommy. Take a picture. But that's just what school and that was like, though. There's our first trophy. Ouch. She left out amnation. What's that? Dear Katie, uh, I didn't, didn't know it was, is it Katie Marsh then? It's not Kate Marsh. It's Katie. I didn't know that. No spirit or devil could have prepared me for what you have done in that videotape. And like the Jezebel, you released your harlot image before God's eye. I will pray with my church for your soul to be saved from internal health. Get off her fucking back, man. What the hell? So it's not just the people in the school. It's even Good the people, even the people this must around This be Kate's it. HR Geiger period. What arseholes, man? They're all fucking arseholes. Kate's room is usually immaculate. For her, this must be a pigsty. Maybe Kate has a split personality. Church girl by day, party monster by night. She's got a Bible. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. I'm definitely not a religious person. If you's a, a religious person, post, post, post in the comments. Uh, I am what they call a atheist. That's someone who's not doesn't believe in any form of God. What's this? Uh, Proverbs. When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the evildoers. Then the first one. Matthew eleven twenty eight. Come to me, all you who you are weary and burdened, I will give you rest. What's that? Damn, it's the all-American zombie family. <laughs> it's way too emo in here. Mm -hmm. Kate isn't that gloomy. No, she... Until lately. No. She looks really sad. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. Mm -hmm. That's the world. Uh, hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate. I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of a Vortex Club. Yeah, right. What about the video? Did you, uh... Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. <laughs> you know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. It doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Mm. Nathan Prescott? Oh shit. 
He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. Mm, he He's was. the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. And I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Mm. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. <laughs> I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... <laughs> and... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. Man. You have to really feel sorry for a man. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? I think it's a waste of time because they own a everyone that's in the town. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Hmm. Good job, Dr. Max. <laughs> she didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. We could go back in, in time, but I, I don't think it's going to make a massive change, if I'm being honest. I think we can take a picture of in here, is there? So if you think, yeah, let's leave. Oh, what's this? Why did she cover up the mirror? She can't look at herself? Damn. That sucks, though. It, they're all just, oh, they're just all arseholes. Oh, Yeah, mate. I I really feel for Kate. I really do. It, but that's like that is the kind of shit that you get in stuff like school and that. It's not nice. Uh, shall I knock? Mm. Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria. Yeah, I think we've gone everywhere around here, haven't we? Yeah, let's just head out. Let's leave the girls' dorms. But yeah, Kate's character I felt very sorry for. Um, shit that I was doing. Had one in our school called Kate too. Oh, really? Um, what was... Um, were they in our year? Uh, if I used that, no. Um, me and Josh went to the uh, same school. If basically you didn't know. There's Taylor. Let's just Hi, speak Taylor. to Taylor. Hi, Taylor. <laughs> just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. Ooh. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, 
let's just talk for once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Also. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. Hmm. Looks it. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Hi, Taylor. Hi, Taylor. I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. What what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. This action will have consequences. Let's talk to Samuel. Hey, Samuel. You're up early. Oh, he's weird. Hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. He's so weird. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. So... What did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. <laughs> I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. <laughs> he's so... he's so weird. <laughs> he's so weird though. The birds are flocking around Samuel. Is there anyone else here to uh, who I could talk to? How hard is it to dump the trash into a bin? Release the kraken! Come on, squirrels! So Time innocent. Your Fifteen minutes of fame. <laughs> I better not get near the bench, or the squirrel won't take the food. Eat the food. Why does it keep trying to? Go on, take it. Do you gonna take the food? Can I take it? Hmm. I don't know if you can get a trophy for that. That's the one thing with this game, uh, you'll be really patient with all the trophies and that. Scaffolding. The paint job looks great. Samuel knows his color schemes. Squirrel. Aha! Yes! Another Pulitzer for the portfolio. I fucking knew there was going to be a trophy. It's our second one. Thank you, Squirrel. 
can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Most like most likely not, because they're ran by all the football and stuff like that. Oh, what's this? I've never seen Samuel wearing <laughs> shades. And what's with this other crap? Mm -hmm. Don't think I wanna know. <laughs> I think that's everything here. Nothing else is there. Alright, let's get on, because Chloe will be waiting. Oh, private number. This is Nathan's father. This message is to let you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son will be met with many l lawyers and legal ramifications. You're not the first student at Blackwell to try, so I hope you're the last to consider this a polite final warning. Yeah, I'm sure um, it's really nice for your son to be carrying a gun around. I'm sure that's really nice. Is that a? Is it just as that's that? Yeah. Max, oh. come on over here. Hello, Warren. Warren, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call. I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. <laughs> Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Hmm. I busted him, don't get involved. I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. No, You're not. fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! No, I don't think I can concentrate on going out to the movies. I just feel like escaping. Fine. Be a damn dirty human. I'll go eat myself. Yeah, sorry, Warren. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Been pretty decent so far though this this one's a bit slower so hopefully the uh, pace uh, picks up but um when i'm not sure uh, david talking to nathan oh. cannot be a good thing hmm. this has something to do with kate or rachel rachel amber guess we're going to the diner Oh, this is another scene I like. It's really cool. And the songs were bangers on this game, though. I honestly can't remember a game that had this many great songs. other ones that did the songs very well was Life is Strange 2 and uh, True Colors. Mm. 
And if, if if you guys played the original, do you think there's a massive change in terms of the newer games? In terms of this, I like the new hair graphics, and I like how they've enhanced the backgrounds. They've done that a lot better. In terms of the game itself, they've not changed nothing, really, like how scenes play out. So I, I, I don't know if I'd say if it's worth getting, I'm not sure. But, like, at the price, they had it out at the time. But for a decent price, I would say it's worth it. Cause this is for one of the best um, choice-based games actually out there. It basically kicked things off. Really? I'm ready to cash my luck. <laughs> Glad somebody is. Don't try to take it. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. I'm going to be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. Let's talk to her. She looks busy and stressed. Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? Sure. I can't even afford to live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. Text from Chloe. No emoji, running late. Grab a booth at the diner. Mum will feature. I'll be lucky if you make it by noon. <laughs> you can't have my lottery ticket. Buy your own. That's rude. Oh, that's okay. Let's see if we can see anything around here. Is there anything to see around here? Oh, hello, doggy. Oh. Okay. There was some. There was that dirty RV from the other day. Ah, oh, that was the one that was on the school grounds. Obviously, nobody took my advice. Yeah, that's the one that was on the school grounds, weren't it? What's this? Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Uh, has the town, has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard, it has. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. <laughs> you have your own boat? I call her the Bali High. I've kept a hold of her in these lean days. Might be all the time we've got left. I thought one of Arcadia Bay's main exports was fish. Oh, the fish used to jump on them like that. Until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. The Prescotts have a lot of power. Mm -hmm. They might rename the town Prescott Bay. <laughs> that tells you much. It's true. <laughs> Do you know them? Do good for my working kind. But I know them through their bad deeds. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. He looks like a photo of the classic Arcadia Bay crusty fisherman. Can you speak to You can't have my lottery ticket. Uh. Buy your own. 
can, can you go I don't want to go that way. Oh, you can't actually you, you explore. Oh, I was going to try it. I was going to try and explore. What about going across the road? No, can't. Okay, let's just go into the diner. Ooh. What about this guy? I wonder if they explained that snow. Yeah, if you didn't know, I like to explore a lot. Newspapers are going to be retro soon. Excuse me, sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, and our big headline is snow. You can hardly wait for next week's big story. Clouds! <laughs> um. How long have you lived here? Long enough to know that Arcadia Bay will be a ghost town in a few years. I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that or about missing girls. You mean Rachel Amber? I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? <laughs> Excuse me. I have to read my horoscope. Oh, sorry, Mr. Busy. Poor woman. I hope it's a shelter for her. Hello. It can be rough. Oh, look at you. <laughs> a fine example of youth. I bet you're a senior student. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. Was she in uh, the other game? I don't remember her. Um... You must know Joyce Price from the Two Whales Diner. She's fed me more than my own family. Mm -hmm. I was a daughter your age who's always in trouble. Married Chloe, to yeah. a real prick. <laughs> At least she's honest. His name is David Madsen. He told me to get a job once, asshole. Not sure what Joyce sees in him, but he better treat her right. I bet you have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia Bay. <laughs> Those days are dead, mm -hmm. like anything in their way. I know somebody who's been threatened by a press card. Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family, especially not the law. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. Yeah. Almost. How long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? A thousand years. I've gone through the same changes as the town. What happened to you? What didn't happen to me? Sometimes you start out in life turned around the wrong way. I married dumb, made mistakes, got cheated out of my savings, lost my home, and now I hang out here. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. I have to go now. Goodbye. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. Don't hit it. Haha. That's a little sneaky trophy there. That was hidden. A little sneaky one that is. If you are still watching the stream though, I hope you guys are all enjoying the stream and hope you guys are all having a good time. This has been good so so far, you get to explore quite a bit. I'll try and talk as much as I can. If you drop any comments in the uh, chat, I'll see it on the main screen as well as on my laptop where I've got this stream. I wonder if they explained that snow. There we go. Let's go. Mm -hmm. mm, missing... I have put a missing uh, Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware. Now that brings back memories. <laughs> Chloe and I loved the parade. Can we talk to people? <laughs> Did you catch any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Now let me mourn over my eggs. Alright, Jesus. You're so moody. 
hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? She's definitely Canadian. Oh man, I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. Why does that so not sound fun? <laughs> This guy has serious corners. Is that the guy from outside? I might make Chloe check this out with me. Just let's have a look around. The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Of course it wouldn't. They want to make it sound good. That doesn't fit their profile. You never know how weird this town is by these postcards. <laughs> Do you have anything in here? Kate Marsh, Lo love you long time. That's nice, isn't it? Um, Rachel. Oh. Rachel Amber owes me a BJ, and so does your mum. Gross. That's nice. That's nice, isn't it? What's this? Fire walk with me. Oh. Another picture. Picking up a good few trophies here. There's so many that you miss. It's actually crazy how many you miss when you rush the game. Thank you, redneck poet. What's been said in here? Um, I. What's that? I. Aim to misbehave. And this one flushed before pissing on the floor. <laughs> that graffiti has been here forever. Is there one on the other side? No, that one's shut. You can't take a picture of that one. That's everything in it. There's a lot of things that you miss when you're rushing through the game. So many things. What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer, so spare me, please. Let me suffer quietly. Uh, okay. That officer looks nicer than wannabe cop David Madsen. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now, that is a real problem at the uh, Two Wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese. <laughs> So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <laughs> Poor Joyce. Just heard that Chloe even had a pot dealer in her room. Uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scanner. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? She wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell the loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching. Yeah. Is she a friend of yours? Um. I know her. Then you know she's a handful. Mm. She can be, but. She can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joyce so much stress. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that <laughs> word. We know each other. Why do you ask? He kind of has a reputation at Blackwell. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. Mm. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. 
I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Fair enough. Alright, let's try and talk to this next guy. Who's that? Trevor. I don't feel like talking right now. Okay. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Over and out. Um, okay. Uh, hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. You sound like Joyce. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Joyce rules. I want to be exactly like her when I grow up. Looks like you're on your way. I've been coming to this dive for three years, and Joyce gives me shit like it's going out of style. That's how she rolls. That's why I worship her every move. Good. I can't wait to see you flipping greasy bacon in a diner when you grow up. Exactly like Joyce. Now pardon me while I get back to my coffee. Wow. He's rude. Drool. Want everything. It's true, that does look dummy. Do I know if it feels... Oh, what's this? Didn't see this before. <laughs> Forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Hmm. There's lots of things that you don't pick up on them the first time you play this game. Whoa, Ken Kesey with Joyce? <laughs> That's so perfect. What's this? I got you, babe. <laughs> How apropos. But no fucking way. That's funny. Our family never went well watching. It looks fun. Do anything else? Or is that everything? Do I speak to these guys? Hey, Trevor. Uh, Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You cracked me up, Maxer. Of course I'm baked. So I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Fair, fair play. Let's sit at this one. Let's sit at this booth. You guys are still watching the stream. Post, post a comment if you guys are enjoying the stream. And I hope you guys are all having a good day so far. Here comes Joyce. Good old and Joyce. There she is. <laughs> a lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. <laughs> I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man. No matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm sorry. Oh, it surprised me fierce. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were hard for you and Chloe. I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did, after William passed on.
Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. <laughs> Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Um, Chloe understands. Chloe has changed. Um, Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. Well, he doesn't. I see why. It, I mean, do it you? Doesn't help. He's not as much of a hard ass as you think. But you did tell him you had a joint, right? You took that responsibility. I did, and I am sorry. I don't want Chloe in any more trouble. Or me. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. And I admire that you took the heat for Chloe. Like a great friend. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but... I stay out of his business. Mm. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want to eat? Bacon omelette. Belgian waffle. The last good Belgian waffle I had was here easy. when I was 13 years old. So, bring it on. Love, now finish your coffee. Love a waffle. What we got One here? One Belgian waffle for the hungry girl, pronto. The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. I guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Horses. Can I get some beer and bacon before I die? The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. This is a diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> Looks like you had no graffiti. Warren must have been here. Let's <laughs> drink that. Order ready. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back no in time. What, what kind of dive is this? Incoming. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. <laughs> here, you'll love this. I'm drooling like a baby. Mm -hmm. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, oh. Speaking of the devil. Mm, speak of the devil. <laughs> Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl. A woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. <laughs> Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. But he is, you guys are still he is a same. dick. Another reason to blow this town? What is this shit on the jukebox? <laughs> now that that's out of the way... Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. Oh. I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. 
right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Okay. Impress me. Um, gun. Let's see. A gun? I left it in the car. Eh, wrong answer. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Okay. Let's have a look. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. So you're key with a panda. How many cigarettes? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cigarettes. Um. 10, 20, 30, um, that 10? Quarter dollar coins, one quarter equal 25 cents. What is that, the quarters? So you're one cent uh, coins, five cent coins. Okay, so quarter, so 25, 50, 75, uh, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, and 1034. I'll get that one. Okay, I think I know some of it. We won't get it all done at once, I promise you that. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. You have cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Money. Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? 80... Is it 86? 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. Come on. So that was cool. Show me more. It's the parking ticket I'm gonna struggle with. A parking ticket? You know me well. But, what is the exact time I was busted? Uh, I think it was 10.34. 10.34 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time! Even a broken clock is right twice a day. What the hell that means? Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. Come on! Got it all in one. No mistakes. Amazeballs. I literally just got chills all over my neck. You have powers. <laughs> I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you I'm sure that I could actually remember that because I can't I remember jack future. shit. No way. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Then that That's the best song I've this ever This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. 
I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Okay. Oh shit, oh it's got to replay all over again. Fuck. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh, and now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. You are still watching the stream, I hope you guys are enjoying this one. This one's been a bit of like a filler. Outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. But it just gets you used to Chloe and Maxie's um, friend. Friendships basically, it gets you used to those two, and then it focuses a bit on Kate, Kate Marsh as well. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Weren't we meant to redo it? Oops! Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh! And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick! Don't slap me, bitch! Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That's the best song I've this heard. This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Hmm. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Okay. Four? Mm. Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? What are we meant to be doing here? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can <sighs> dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Okay. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Okay, so... Was it Joyce that dropped her plate? Trevor drops his glass. Cop drops. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? Alert on cop's radio and he leaves. Um, his partner leaves. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. I don't think that's what happened. <laughs> um, Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce stops them. Joyce doesn't care. Joyce encourages them. <laughs> Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. And the jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls in it, as a fly stands on it, as a butterfly goes on it, as a chucker plays in its own hands. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Let's see. I'll probably get a couple things wrong. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? 
You called it. And he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. <laughs> you predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. For every single one more. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that! Of course it's a toy! The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! <laughs> Grow up. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. <laughs> you can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then, <laughs> let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. You gonna just leave all, all, all that food behind? you to watching a stream now i hope you guys are all enjoying and posting comments what you's are all up to uh today i would like to hear what your plans are just uh playing the, se the, se the second episode for but today only on your first oh. my stomach plans ahead right. your stomach is okay stomach. super girl Winter let's go to my secret place oh. don't even answer we have places to go and people to do Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. We need to, an we need to answer. Hey Kate, what's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please, go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. Let's rock. Come on, Chloe. Don't be a dick. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. Still morning. Thank you. Okay, let's just head out. I don't think there's anything else to see here, is there? Um, is there any pictures that we've got to take? Um, but if a user plays this game, uh, post in the comments of the stream uh, what you guys are thought of uh, this game, and if. If you played the other ones, where it ranks with with all of the other games. Another poster. Don't know where it ranks with. I, I, I go back and forth between this and True Colors. It's a uh, very close. I think my least favorite one is Before the Storm, and I've got Life is Strange Two. Inferred. Here we go. Is this a race? Keep and if, up. And if you are all enjoying the stream, definitely drop me a follow so the next well you the next time on the live then you'll uh, get a to notification. Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. <laughs> Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back and she's also super sized. <laughs> we don't know for how long. Mm -hmm. Exactly why it's time to have fun. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> After yesterday, I'm kind of over guns, Chloe. <sighs> Freaks me out that you have one. Don't you trust me? Yes, but not that gun. You have more power than an army. Don't be scared of my little toy. Besides, we need it for the test. What test? Drink? Yuck. <laughs> you are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. 
Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Cool. Beer and guns? <laughs> nice combo. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles. Pretty please. Let's have a look around. So... This is where we came in. Nope, I don't want to go there. Okay, so we go from here. Okay. Alright, let's have a look for these bottles, guys. And see if there's any trophies to pick up as well. <laughs> That's my Chloe. Every car has its own tale and history. There's a lot here. Let's have a look around. All this rusted metal makes me feel serene. Am I morbid or just God? Certainly. Yeah. This looks like a graffiti museum for mm -hmm. Chloe and Rachel. Yeah. I bet I can find out more about Rachel here. Mm -hmm. That kind of hurts. Chloe and Rachel. Oh yeah, they have best friends uh, bracelets. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. <laughs> Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. There you go. That's one bottle. Hello, bottle number one. I want to die. <sighs> Jeez. Who wrote this? My name's Lucky Chloe. Ouch. Mm. Fuck you. Yes, you. Chloe was here. Rachel was here. I don't want to intrude, but mm. I was here. If I remember correctly, they wrote that in before the storm. If now I, we're officially a trio. If I remember. We just have to find Rachel. Mm. <laughs> I don't want to intrude, but I was here. So Rachel did go to a Vortex Club party. Mm -hmm. This flyer is dated right before she disappeared. Mm -hmm. What's this? Now, what's up with this weird secret relationship? Sounds like Rachel was confused about it, maybe even ashamed. I wish she named names. <laughs> I, I better not show this to Chloe or she will be seriously hurt. So, C, which I'm, I'm guessing means Chloe. You can tell how much I want you to read this letter since I've been dragging my ass to give it to you. May, maybe I just want you to find it when I'm not around so we never have to talk about it and I don't want you to hate me. Where to start? I met somebody recently who's so different from the lame Vortex Club snobs. I know you'll have a meltdown when I tell you and, I f uh, and think he's gross but I swear he's wise and unconventional. Kind of scary, not in a bad boy way. He's just experienced some serious shit. Yes, I'm kind of obsessed. I won't blame you for freaking. Maybe I know you're right and this has to be my secret. I hate not sharing this with you, except I know you'd give me that stink eye and grill me for every stupid detail. If I even told you last night we hooked up near campus. Ouch. Damn. Did not know about that. Can we remove anything? What's that on the floor? What they would have gone all the way to Los Angeles for a rave. Looks fun. I wonder who that guy is, um, who she was going on about. Oh, Chloe sucked at that, Jesus. Alright, let's go on the outside. 
there's no what's that there's no mofo here what the fuck's mofo i don't want to go that way okay let's go back around what's this eat shit and Thanks live for the tip. that's a good motto Well, I only found one bottle so far, so this is a part that. Um... I wonder how many generations of fashion went through that washing machine. <laughs> yeah, because it's my second time going through the game. Like this, it, like I, I literally can't remember where all the bottles were. What's this? So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. Uh, if you are just looking in my sh uh, stream, I uh, really do appreciate the viewership, guys. And if you guys do enjoy my streams, definitely don't uh, forget to drop me a follow, as it really helps me to grow. Oh, that's going to drop in it. Ah, uh, bottle broke. Can we go back in time and fix it? Look what we have here. A cute little bottle for the taking. Yes. I don't think that's going to go well. Where to find bottles? Ah! Maybe in an old refrigerator. Alright, use this crate. And that'll be our second bottle. And then, we can get the bottle. Get that. Bottle number two. Boom, only three bottles left. Okay, there's nothing there. Let's head to the next section. Oh, number three. Oh, hit me up anytime if you have any later questions. I'll be at Tardis Kit. Okay, I'm gonna text him quick. Okay, cool. That's the third three bottle. Down, two more to go. Talk about finding a bottle in a haystack. Just need two more now. I wonder now. if Chloe thinks about her father when she looks at all these smashed up cars. Mm-hmm. It's a sad story there. Wow, sir. <laughs> that looks exactly like the same dough from my tornado vision. It does. It does. That dough is the perfect photo op. There we go. I'm assuming that's another trophy. There we go. Need that one more bottle. What's this? Ah, oh, you can sit on there. Oh, okay. Let's it's have so some quiet thoughts. and primordial out here. I always feel like the forest is whispering to me. <laughs> like Arcadia Bay is trying to tell me something. Yeah, it's saying get the fuck out the out the town. I just out have to figure town. out the message. So guys, just trying to straighten up my laptop. So if you guys drop me chats, I can see them. That's nice. I I like stuff like that when you can do stuff like that. Um, you you just sit and then. She uh, talks her thoughts. It's pr pretty. That's quite cool. They did that in uh, True Colors actually as well. Didn't know they did it in this one. So that's that's really cool. Right, let's have a look around here. See if there's anything. No, me. I'm gonna miss something. I hope you guys are all enjoying the stream today. This 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 one's a bit slower than the first. Episode. I find this one's a bit of a filler one, and uh, it's a bit it's a bit of a slower one, but still, still good though. Where 
this is the last, oh, not the last bottle, we've still got two more to get. I know where the other one is, it's up on this uh, boat, and you've got to get up there. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. You trying to say something to me, Max? Something that I'm not seeing? This was an old school punk shirt. Mm hmm that's probably Rachel's. Or something like that. Mm, I bet I'm missing something. There's nothing there, is there? Hmm. These parts get really annoying in the game, guys, but. Once I can find this last bottle on the ground, wherever it is, um, I can go up to the other one. Do any bottle up here? What's this thing about a bonfire? I don't think it's in this section, is it? No. Okay. Oh, does that be where the smoke's coming from? No. Oh shit! Campfire. Bottle! There we go. Got that one. One more bottle to go. What's this? I'm sure this is a I'm sure this is a popular party pit. Oh, got a text from Kate. Um Max, sorry to have bothered you by asking for your advice. I guess I shouldn't do anything uh, but let people enjoy my video all over the world. Kate, that is uh, not what I meant. I just want you to be careful. Too late, I guess, but thank you for answering the call this morning. I really needed a friend and you delivered. I'm on your side. Ah, damn it. Let's move out of there. And we've got to get up to that last bit. If I remember correctly, because it's my second time playing this game, it's been a long time since I've played it, so I don't remember every little thing in the game. But if I remember correctly, it's up here, it's up there, it's up on that boat. How we get up there is a whole other thing. Do we use that? Way heavier than I thought. Ugh. And then, oh, is there anything up here beforehand? Before we go over there. What's that? The Bigfoots were here. Is there nothing else? Is that the only thing? Yeah, okay. Let's head straight over. And that is the f fifth bottle, is it? Or is Whoa. it a sieve? Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. Oh, we can sit. Let's have a seat. Although this junkyard is a dive, I see why Chloe hangs here. Mm -hmm. She's a steampunk. It actually feels like Chloe and I are kids again. <laughs> We're hiding out and plotting our future. Despite all the chaos and bullshit, I feel so giddy hanging out with her again. <laughs> so happy. Like we've both gone back in time. I like those things though, because uh, you get a hero force and that kind of stuff. Like uh, I remember when they did that in the True Colors game. I liked it on there as well. Right, let's get past that. Head back down this way. 
We've got all the bottles now. And let's talk to Chloe. Thanks, Max. Wait, one more for the road. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Mm. <laughs> Max, you have to help me aim. Wait, what? Show me the way, Max. Um. I need to see you shoot first. A bit to the right. So I should rewind and help Chloe hit those bottles. Okay. So no, damn it. Go to the right. No right. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Oh yeah. <laughs> Duh. That was so fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. So be a bit up. Aim up. slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. <laughs> now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here. Mm. Give me something to shoot, Max. Mm. Let's see you take a crack at that rusty barrel. Sorry, Mr. Barrel. Your time has come. <laughs> Listen to those fat bullet beats. Did we do that correctly? No. Hello, what should I shoot? Aim at that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. Did we do that? Yawn. Okay, you did enjoy that, okay. You could just said you didn't enjoy it, but okay. What? Fine, since you won't play, I'm gonna shoot this barrel. Huh? Root. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? I don't like this. It's gonna rebound. Hella yes! Oh! Was that? Nice shooting. Tech. Oh, nice. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like never. So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that jumper for a target now? Mm. Dude, I want to see that windshield go down. Watch out for flying glass. <laughs> you guys better run for cover. Yet the bottle remains. Okay, so we've got to find something that rebounds for that to happen. Okay. Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Put a real dent in that front bumper. Goodbye, cruel bumper. Oh shit! Jesus, I shot myself! Ugh, I shot myself! Back up! Back Stupid up! gun! Hold on, Chloe. I better rewind right now. Okay, okay, okay. We're rewinding. Oh Jesus, no, I no, I did it again! Oh, I shot myself! Back up, back Stupid up! Stupid gun! Hold on, Chloe. Okay, we're backing up. We need a target before I shoot. Okay. 
Well, Max? Alright, let's, let's go right back. Well, Max? How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning. Haha, uh -huh, I do that yeah. every time. Literally, bro. <laughs> there we go. We got it that time around. Was waiting for it. <laughs> Uber cool. That's some cool I cannot handshake. Believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. <laughs> mm. I don't know. Oh shit. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! <laughs> That is what I did like in this one, where it, it explains the strengths and what she can do with this re rewind power or ability. That is what I did. That's what I did like about the second one. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. I'm glad I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. Oh, let's take a picture. You can never get enough pictures of Chloe. Another trophy. There we go. Is there anything else we've got to take a picture of around here? If you use if you have played this game before, definitely let me know if there's any other pictures that you need to take around this area. Because I can't remember if there is. Do you always miss something when you go through this game? I'll probably I'll be able to do it when I come off stream. Um, but I hope I hope you guys have been enjoying the stream for today day though. I try and talk as much as I can. And if you've got any comments or like uh, any questions about the game, definitely post them in the uh, stream. It'd be really cool. No, we already looked at that, didn't we? What about this? No, we already looked at that. Okay. Looks at that already. Hmm. So if we already go all over this, we've been in the air, we? La La Land this way. That's a decent. That's a decent film. Um, I think that's everything really is. Nothing that we ain't really looked at is there, so let's go back to Chloe. I don't think there's anything else really. So let's go back to Chloe. And if there is, then I'll do it when I'm off stream. I, I, I won't waste time when I'm on stream. There we go. Okay, looks like you're ready to lock and load. Let's go. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this, and I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Mm-hmm, Frank. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Mm -hmm. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Uh -huh. Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? <laughs> what are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? <laughs> a friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. 
Give it to me right now, asshole! You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? <laughs> Please. Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Come on, girly. Shoot me. It's not. Ah, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me, or I'll track you down with this interest. Have a good play, kids. You really stood your ground. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. Not cool. I know, Max. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. And there are more guns out there. <laughs> Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. If I remember correctly, that's the person oh, man. that Rachel was Frank took Chloe's that. gun because of me. Do we rewind it? And get a better outcome? Wow, I don't... Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? Because Faye was we a thing. We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. That was a thing. That's um, who um, Chloe was writing that letter about. It's Frank. If I remember correctly, if you played before the storm, um, here's a few... Um, if basically you don't want the game to be ruined, then... And uh, just... Uh, yeah, don't listen to this part, but... Um, there was a thing, and when you go into Frank's RV, I think it is, um, then you find out what goes on. And I think Chloe finds. Uh, oh, it must have not been Chloe. It, um, but you do, but you do find out. Just another day of Max's fucked up wife. Chloe didn't know about it. I don't Time think. to go get Chloe. So it must have been just something she didn't know about. But yeah, there was Chloe's definitely a thing. Go for a walk. We both need a time out from here. But yeah, there was, def there was definitely a thing going on now between those two. It's a bit of a strange one now. I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, <laughs> Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me, especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. And I just liked having that gun, man. Mm -hmm. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? <laughs> I wish we could stay forever. Very iconic scene. This bit is. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Mm. Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry, but Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. Mm -hmm. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? You don't mean you... Oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. 
I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Uh, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens, <laughs> and it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for <laughs> images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. <laughs> it's the romance of travel and movement. The sound Feels of the like no time has passed when you're here. with the right people. It's true, mate. I'd rather be a good photographer. <laughs> you are. You just have to stop being afraid. Definitely use this bad boy. Hurry! Shit, I can't budge it at all. Come on. Score. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. Yeah, hold on. Max, get me out of here! I don't want to die here! Alright, I need more time. I can't even move it in. Yeah, I need more time. Train up. I'm trying. Bear with me. Which wire to cut? Always cut the red one. Now that's the right thing. Yes, I did it. Move. Get out of the way. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate <laughs> spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers 
might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. And that part is stressful. <laughs> Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. <laughs> um, explain what? Um, I doubt it. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh, it means shit happens, right? No, crazy shit happens. Because it can. And will. Why me? I'm oh, that's the name girl of the next a perfect example e of strange attractions. Episode, right? They teach you kids chaos theory. We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. <laughs> Second half of this uh, episode de definitely picks up. I think the start of it is really slow, but it definitely picks up. <laughs> I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Oh, Mr. Wells. Fuck. So, are you going to that Vortex Club party? Like I would miss it. I Justin have to always outfit. looks down. What's that with him? Mm. Hello, Mr. Wells. Joe, I'm not even. I don't, I don't even want to speak to him. That guy's an arsehole. Maybe you owed money to Frank, too. I don't think she did. Hello, Zachary. Hello, Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. It's over. Just another Blackwell mini drama. You mean stupid shit. Man, I just don't get Victoria. What does she want? Probably for all of us to talk about her. Like now. Then let's not. <laughs> You're pretty smart, Max. See you at the game Friday. Oh, can you go through here? Oh, look at these trophies. You can only look at the trophies. Gotta give it up for those big foots. Can you take they a picture? They do stomp. No. no. Let's talk to this also. Sir? Oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. Mm. Did you talk alleged? to Nathan? Nathan did have a gun. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. <laughs> I don't blame him. Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. I Meaning can't focus when I'm scared. You're doing nothing. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. Our head of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. Hmm. Hassle Kate. I saw Mr. Madsen hassle Kate Marsh yesterday. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? <laughs> You're full Probably shit, man. not the same one you see. It's mm -hmm. very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's next? 
Now, if you'll excuse me, <laughs> you're full of shit, mate. You are full of shit. Can we take a picture of this? No. Can we talk to Courtney? Unfortunately, yes. Uh, let's see. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. What a dickhead. You're awesome. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. Really? Oh, like you... I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Thanks, Max. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell you what. I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. It's action with consequences. Oh, it's not good. I uh, can't talk to Trevor. Oh, hello, Mr. Dickwad. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Mm. Was that really your reefer? Yes. Yes, it was. You know that marijuana is almost legal in Oregon. I can get it at Blackwell. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. Talking about Kate Marsh? Um, what about what Kate? What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Nah, man. You're just causing trouble. Warren. Um, I'm in the sci-fi lab now. Okay. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. And her friends shopping for the party. That reminds me, I have to score some weed from Nathan. Oh, that's a science class, so that's where he is. Hello, Juliet. Juliet is laying the smack down on Zachary. Who's that? Evan. Yo, Maxwell Smart. Talk later, cool? Maybe oh. this is your way of getting attention. So you can't help me? I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Can we talk to Kate? No. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Oh, sorry. Um... Yes, we did. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. 
I assume you know about this viral video. Kate is freaked <laughs> out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? <laughs> what does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel, too. But think about yourself, <laughs> Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello? Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Hmm. Let's speak to what's her name? Miss Grant. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. Thanks again for taking a stand against camera surveillance here. Every signature counts. Um. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do this love the season change. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. Um. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. <laughs> I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. I've been here a little longer, but he's made a bigger mark. I have to say, it's not quite autumn enough yet. I can't wait for fall either. It's all about the atmosphere. You're the artist and I'm the scientist. Like yin and yang. How's your campaign going? You signed the petition, now it's your campaign too. Thanks for stepping up. More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. That's how they keep us all distracted. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. I know. I really hope you keep those cameras from taking over Blackwell. Max, with students like you, we sure will. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. Okay. Let's see if there's anything around here. I don't think there is. Sweet to Brooke. Bro. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? How is your drone? Miss Grant busted me flying it over the parking lot. She's all jacked up about surveillance bullshit. Like I was spying on Warren's new car. You already planted a GPS on him? I borrowed the one he has on you. I hate to hit and run, <laughs> but... Don't let me get in your way. So long. Okay. Bit weird, but okay. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer! Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Mm. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. Weird science. Hey, War. Maxwell's asking me. I have to add you. Lots of potassium. 
I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. See? Look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Let's do this thing. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> she blinded me with science. <laughs> yes! That was a blast. But let's keep it a professional secret. Cool? Oh, man, that was jokes. Bring me the brain, Igor. Nothing else in this room, I don't think. Okay, let's go straight through here. Hello, Stella. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Bow, bow, bow. I'm Dana. You are out of control. Turn left, then right. Show me the love. Let's see the drawing. That's a great sketch of Dana. Um. Daniel is the real deal. Look, Taylor, you look like ass. Hello, Alyssa. Oh, we can take a picture. Excellent. Another trophy. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. Um, fair enough. Anything to take here? Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine digital images. But I still dig my little instant camera. No uh, time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm no sure time to talk, Max. Art in progress. Like I give a flying fuck. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. Gives me hope. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all, Victoria. Max is such an attention whore. <laughs> you would know. Can I sit down now? Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. <laughs> yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. Piss off. Assholes. Mm-hmm. Where's Kate? Mm -hmm. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. <laughs> what up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier, and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. I'll see we you have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> Awesome. Not feeling good. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson Sounds published like his own little book of photo tips. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usual. <laughs> no smartphones in class, Max. Put that away. People need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for something. <laughs> In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking I of guess Kate will miss class now. I'm worried about her. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang, 
Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrasts. Although we don't technically see in my Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girls' dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. <laughs> Dismissed. in a time in a time loop oh, yeah, there you go. not again not now I have to try something I won't be able to rewind again and again frozen time. I know the majority of stuff that happens because uh, I've played through it before but it's been quite a while since I've gone through it. This is the part I'm hoping I can remember because you've got to try and save Kate. Definitely don't want Kate to uh, die. Kate's too good. Oh. Quickly get my charger from my laptop. If I can see any comments yes. that you use, uh, put in the chat. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, here we go. And I don't think she can rewind any anymore, so... Uh, mm -hmm. What are you doing here, Mac? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now! It won't work! I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself? <laughs> Max, seriously, don't come near me! I will jump! Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. You matter, and not just to me. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours, and we can get through this together. Let me help. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. I'll always be here for you, Kate. My new motto is, friends come first. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? 
What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing! Kate, I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. You have proof now? Soon. Then straight to the police. Think of it like we're cleansing Blackwell. You do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So, I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm horny on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No! Nobody cares about me! Nobody! Kate, I saw that card from your father. You can count on him. He clearly loves you without question. Dad does care, even though I hurt him. He's the only one I know who believes in me. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. What are you talking about? You saved me from talking in class. <laughs> Just shows what the world can do to such a nice person. Yeah, mate, I... Honestly, I could, when you read all now, of the I stuff in her room, you find out how to save her. But I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl's life. What? It was of me, course, not you. For getting Kate to come down, Max. I didn't do much. She's modest, like a real hero. Yeah, real hero. <sighs> As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. Mm. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. Yeah, they That's did. just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Yeah, my fault exactly. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Yeah, Nathan. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Oh. Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please. Tell us everything. Jefferson made her cry. That's not true. David bullied her. I also don't think that's true. Nathan dosed her. Fuck you, Nathan. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're playing a liar. the field. Mm -hmm. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. 
How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Ooh. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. <laughs> See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please <laughs> sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. Yeah, let's sign it. Fuck you, Nathan. I wish you the worst. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. <laughs> I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand. And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen. Ever! You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Not quite. Look at me. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. I'm still worried about Kate. Mm -hmm. She did try to kill herself. <clears throat> All over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. Lauren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof <clears throat> that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? Mm -hmm. The weather confirms this weird day. Another bullet, another bullet. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. Mm -hmm. I would know. I would. I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. The songs just make these scenes so great. They just fit the style of the game. Did they did really well? The only issue, when you stream it on like um, another platform, it, they will mute that scene because the songs. On Twitch it's not so bad. Twitch is actually, that's actually one of the good things about Twitch. They don't actually mute that uh, stuff. I think that, that they used to, but if you actually appeal it, then they're not that strict. So, very lucky there. What's up, uh, Megan? Hope hope things are good on your end. Stream started here about 12ish, so I try and get um, some other people more involved. So I try and get you into my streams. <laughs> I think I streamed the other day, it was like around 3 p.m. It's really late to stream around that time. But it's been good viewership uh, today. 
been really good on uh, four views at the moment, so it's been really good. So cheers to everyone that has uh, dropped by into the stream. I've liked this one. Not been as good as the first episode, but still, still good. Hey, Kate. You have to love Kate, man. She's she's fucking awesome. <clears throat> if you if you are watching a stream, man, you're watching from like another um, place. So I'm located in the UK. What's What's the time in your time uh, time zone at the moment? Uh, I'm good, just finally got out of bed. Uh, kind of late for... Uh, because it's my day off. Oh yeah, yeah, cool. So, like, go and have fun on your day off. <laughs> it's usually uh, up two hours earlier than this. <laughs> nah, just uh, have fun with the to rest in and that. Ten AM for me right now. Oh, okay. That's that's actually not too bad. So um, I start up my streams at twelve, so it's not too bad. Because I think I uh, remember when I used to do my streams like really fucking soon in the morning. I I was doing them around like nine or ten in the morning, and that was really um, that was tricky on um, to get you involved in my streams. Because always always like to see you drop by. Let's have a look at all these. So, full 48%. Uh, you told Kate to go to the police. 52% uh, you told Kate to wait for more proof. I just felt that made more sense. Um, you answered uh, Kate's uh, call. That was 82%. And the 18% didn't answer Kate's call. Whoever didn't pick up Kate's call. Come on, man. That's low. 51% um, you tried to shoot Frank. 49% uh, you didn't try to shoot Frank. I, I just felt it made more... Like, you knew Frank weren't going to do much in that sense, so I just didn't. Um, I'm going to move my camera um, just so you guys can... Or I might even turn off... Uh, not move it. Um, where's best? About there? Well, that still covers up a bit, doesn't it? Um, is that better? Up there? Do it around there for now. So, 28% um, you couldn't save Kate. Honestly, I'm shocked it's that low because with Kate, um, it's kind of it is it's kind of really tough because um, you say one wrong thing and then she dies. Um, because I played the game beforehand, I knew what to say. Don't say I think. Don't say her brothers, don't say her mother, especially not her mother, um, say her dad and then that gets you more on her side. Because um, if you find the stuff in her room, you'll see that she she has a postcard uh, from her dad and her dad is the only one that is being supportive of her, of her life. Her mother literally berated her and basically shamed her basically basically because of the whole stuff that was going around. Fucking arsehole, honestly. Um, then let's get into the last one. Uh, you blamed uh, David, that was 10%. You blamed Mr. Jefferson, 24%. And I uh, blamed Nathan, that was, six, that was 66%. Because I, I, I felt, if you blame Mr. Jefferson, he didn't really do a lot wrong. Like, yeah, could he have been more supportive? Yeah, but he didn't really know what what was going on. So he wasn't really to know in that sense, um, as far as we know. Um, you blamed David. You can't really blame him because at the end of the day, he's just doing his job. Was he a, was, was he a dickhead? Yeah, he should have done a lot more. But I can see it from his point of view. With Nathan, that Nathan... Nathan is just a dickhead. The guy's an arsehole. And I wish him the worst. So, I'm happy I pinned it on Nathan. I don't care what his dad says. He can come at me. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh, 
call call me after stream, bro. Yeah, yeah, man. Cheers, cheers for checking out the stream, bro. Really does help me a lot. Um, my sh my viewership def is definitely improved since going over to this game um, compared to Assassin's Creed. Because with Assassin's Creed, you get lost in the shuffle. So it's really helped going over to this game, and it's more story based this game as well. So I'm very happy. Um, you walk with the plant, 57%. I don't. Uh, it says that you uh, can have a consequence from that. I'm gonna have to see what what that is. Um, but 43% didn't wash the plant. Uh, you helped Alyssa, 66%. 34% didn't help Alyssa. See, with those, the game doesn't tell you precisely if you've got to help out the person or not. So you've got to actually look at it and like you've got to check every little thing or you miss it. Um, so it's with the uh, uh, with the Alyssa stuff, it's like a hit. It's, it's like a hit or miss sort sort of thing. Um, you erased the link to Kate's video, ninety-two percent. You left the link to Kate's video, eight percent. Come on, who whoever's in that, eight percent. Come on, guys. You 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 can do a lot better than that. It's like just rub it off because like just. It's not going to erase it off the web, but at least you're doing your part, so then you're not part of doing the bullying, because there's too much of that shit, man. And Kate didn't deserve that, man. Um, you were friendly with Taylor, that was 55%. You weren't friendly with Taylor, that's 45%. Oh, yeah, she's a hit or miss sort of side character. Um, Got a uh, nice. They talk a bit of her backstory though. That is what I. That's what I did like about this game. Like some characters that are not in the main story or nothing, but they'll get that character involved. I think that's really cool. Um, you accepted Warren's invitation, seventy percent. Um, but I rejected his invitation. Now I was in the thirty percent. Mm, I just don't ship it. I, I don't ship him and uh, Max. I'm not sure if yous are the same. I'm just like, mm, I just don't. <laughs> um, but that's uh, that's just me, guys. <laughs> um, you wrote a message, 61%. You didn't write a message, 39%. When was that? Oh, was that at the um, junkyard? That was at the junk. That was at the junkyard, wasn't it? Oh, okay. Um, and then you tam you tampered with the rail racks. Is it rail tracks? Thirty one percent. You didn't tamper with the rail tracks. Didn't we tam? Didn't didn't we tamper with it? We just moved it, right? I thought I thought I thought that's what it was meant to do. Hmm. It's weird. Um, you g gained an entry to the. Vortex Club Party, that was the 55%. Um, and then you didn't gain the entry, that is 45%. Yeah, that was kind of like, eh, I'll uh, see how it goes. Um, and then you, you helped Warren, uh, 51%. You didn't help Warren, 49%. I just thought it would, it would be funny to see it blow up in his face. That's just me being a jerk. <laughs> I just thought it would be funny. Um, you told on David to Mr. Jefferson. You didn't tell on David to Mr. Jefferson. To be honest, we shouldn't we shouldn't have told him anything. Really, he didn't he didn't do jack shit. So, um, and then yeah, when you go like you can press square and you can see what your friends chose. I don't think many people have played this. Um, So let's put this, uh, put the camera back on the top right. So, sorry about this, guys. When I'm doing all, going through all the stuff at the end of each one, it's I've got to um, go through all that. But um, so what we've gone through at the moment, I will be going back through this. So I'll be going through the collectible mode. I think I missed a few. Um, I'd have to go through it. So when you go back through it, so as you can see here. Um, I got all the stuff I needed in the first three. 
miss one there and miss one there so I'd have to go through them got to go through I missed quite a few to be fair so I missed one there and I missed one each on here so I'd have to go back through them but it shouldn't take me too long so I'll be doing that when I'm off stream I won't do it when I'm on stream guys because I don't like to drag at the streams too much but um, I hope you guys have all enjoyed the stream f f thank you to everyone that has dropped by as it really does help me grow as I try and reach a Twitch affiliate. Um, I'm also trying to get to 100 followers at the moment on one off. So if uh, you pop into my stream and you enjoy the stuff I do, always just drop a comment if you're in the stream and would always like to talk to some new faces. And um, if you guys enjoy the streams I do, then definitely drop me a follow as it really does help me grow my channel and it really helps if you uh, can share my stuff around as it really does help but um, but that's um, I think that's all for today um, my thoughts on this one I enjoyed the first day I enjoyed the first episode a lot more than the second I didn't dislike the second one but I found it was more like it was trying to build stuff in, in terms of like I felt the first half of it, it was really slow. It really didn't have nothing to it. It was, I don't know what it was trying to do. Like it was just really slow. But as soon as you got into the second half of it, it it it, it, it uh, picks up and it got a lot better. Um, so I did enjoy that. I liked the focus on Kate. Uh, I liked that they focus on the friend, the friendship between Max and Chloe. Um, so all round, it was uh, really solid, um, and um, yeah, um, I'm very excited for the next one. As soon as I go off stream, um, I'm gonna go and get the other trophies. Like to call it, I think they call it trophy hunting. So I'll, I'm gonna try and pick up as many trophies as I can on this game and try and not miss nothing. So that's what I'm looking to do for this game when I go off stream. So I try and I, I think in this one I picked up. I think it was around six or seven. Um, let me have a quick check so I can be precise. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you need ten, so I've missed three. So I'll have to go back through that. But if you haven't checked the stream before this, I streamed this on Monday, I believe, and this one I've done today. And the next one be Chaos Theory, and then they dropped, they dropped the name of this um, in the second episode when they was in the car. Chloe called it um, Chaos Theory, so you find out more what's going on. So I'll be streaming at the same time, Friday 12 at noon. So if you if you if you can, uh, definitely drop by. I would. Uh, Love to see user pop into the stream and have some chats with all sorts of people. With basically that's some new faces. If basically that's the same people that come into the stream, it really helps me grow. And um, and if user are also doing some streams, definitely uh, get hold of me on my Twitter, and I would be happy to uh, raid. Uh, let me check on here if there's any people currently who I follow. If I can, if I can raid. Not at the moment, ain't got any people on. But if you are ever, if you guys are ever um, streaming or like any or like anything like that, um, if basically I'll if basically I like the stuff that you do and you get more involved in stuff like that, I will be I will be happy to raid you as soon as I finish my streams. So if I use also stream, I would I would be happy to go and give you the sort. Uh, I'll be I'll be happy to give you guys the support. The same, the same that you give me. So then that we all, we all can grow in that sense. So it really does help me, guys. It really helps that um, got uh, another strong viewership today. Just been stuck around about three or four viewers, but Joe, you know what? I would happily take that because when I was when I was streaming Assassin's Creed, I kid you not. If you're new to streaming, do not stream games that are like so heavy in viewership it's like games like uh fifa uh cod like games like you will not get a viewership and it's the same for assassin's creed i enjoy assassin's creed but if i was to stream assassin's creed i'm doing that 
YouTube, I think. I think I'll stream it on my YouTube. In terms of games that are like shorter in length, and I can fo I can fo I can focus more. I'm doing that. Like I, I, I'll do it on Twitch. When I'm Twitch affiliate, then I've got more ways to go around things. But until then, I need to stick to games that I know I'm going to get my viewership on. So this is that game. For one, I love the Life is Strange games. Um, I would I would be happy to go through tr True Colors again. Um, I fucking love that game. It's so good. If you haven't played it, definitely try it out, guys. Um, but I'm going to be sticking to these games. I'll be done with this probably by next week here, if I'm being honest. Because we've got this one. We've got Chaos Theory. That'll be Friday. If you would want to see me do one at the weekend as well, definitely let me know, guys. Um, and I wouldn't mind doing that. I mostly do Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I'm trying to stick to the same times. So then you know my schedule and you know my consistency. And that's what I'm trying to go for the most. And then you got these two at the end. So you got dark room and polarized. So for now, we'll stick with these. And um, so the next one will be this one. So I'll be doing some trophy hunting. I'll do the off stream, and we'll do this Friday at 12 at lunchtime. Um, but for uh, for some other people that see it in a different time zone, it might be a bit sooner or later. So that's why I switched my times to 12 at noon, because um, um, like I try and work around times where I can get people that always come into my streams, and I can um, get consistent viewership. So I know Josh is always going to pop into my streams. He's been really supporting my channel, and it really does mean a lot. So cheers, cheers for the support there man it really it really does help um i've also got megan that pops into my streams a lot she popped into my streams for assassin's creed um i, I would always stream like nine nine or ten in the morning and in her time zone it's like so bloody early so it wasn't fair on her so i i tried to find a system that works that gets more people involved in my stream that i know that will pop into my stream so if you are not sure how to get more viewers, that's definitely the best. That's the best way to do it. Like if you know some people will show up to your streams, work around them. Don't actually work around what works for you, because uh, because at the end of the day, it's not going to be you that's going to get your viewership. It's going to be the people that will always come into your streams. So you've got to work around them. So just uh, always bear that in mind. So if that if that you wasn't sure how to start out and, and that sort of stuff that's literally the best way to go um but enough of that um just a bit of advice on that sense because that's actually what i've learned since i first did start out on twitch and i'm always learning and always looking to grow in any way i can um but but yeah cheers cheers for the support there uh megan i hope things are good with the kids and that and I uh, hope things have been going well at home, and I uh, hope things are all, all very good on your, your end. No, I uh, hope, hope things are good. Um, haven't spoke to you very lately on my Twitter. Like um, to be honest, I haven't even been on Twitter too much as of as of often. Um, so yeah, but uh, but it's always always good to to, to chat to you. Um, but um, that's the end of the stream for today, guys. I'll be so we've gone through these two, and we'll be on this Friday around lunchtime. So if you have the time, def definitely drop by. And if you're just coming into the stream now, uh, we're just finishing up the stream, and we'll be back again Friday at twelve. And if you haven't already. Definitely drop me a follow if you if you love uh, story based games. Uh, would love a weekend stream. Yeah, man. Like um, I'd probably have to do one for Saturday. I think. I think I'd, I might. I might have to set one up for Saturday. I'll see how we get on um, and that because uh, on Sunday I've got. Uh, I probably won't be home because um, got my niece's uh, 
birthday, and um, I'm learn I'm learning that they they always come first. So I love doing my streaming and doing whatever I like to do, but you got to put the people that you uh, care a lot about. You always put them first. Like I missed my recent live stream when when we got on COD. Um, I was out on that day with uh, my brother-in-law and uh, we went to go and see two films in time we got back I would have just had to shoot off to go and make the stream at home uh, same here I haven't been as active on Twitter very lately yeah it's um it's one of those apps though ain't it like um, you can only take so much of the app I think um, but if if you got any other socials uh, definitely Drop me a message on there. I would, I would be happy to follow you on you on like your other socials. Um, like um, I've got a few of them. I don't use the Discord that much. Uh, use my Insta and use TikTok. Um, so I use them kind of apps. Um, but um, yeah, um, but yeah, um, I missed the cod stream that just went. Um, just basically because um, I didn't just want to rush off, and it's very rude if I would have done that. Put your M mental health first. I don't really use uh, social. So yeah, man. Like, that's it. Like that comes. That comes first. Like, I think you've got to just put so many things first. And I think streaming, as much as I love it, it's not like at the top of my list. Like I want to achieve and do really well, but it's not at the top of my list. Like it's not like because I'm not earning money from it yet. Until you earn money from it, it's a hobby. So I want to progress it into something more, um, but like as 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 I said, with lots of things, it's just about balance, mate. Like all things are balanced for sure. The mental health and the family should be a top priority for sure, and that's 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 where it is. Like I'm hoping I'll be able to get onto the stream with them this uh, Saturday. Um, you got me, C and D, and success gaming I think we're doing a custom um, match um, on Warzone I think uh, I think we're doing a custom so it'll be a bit different I think that's this week I would have to check to just make sure but um, yeah I missed the last one I've got to check out their shorts uh, videos that they uh, did for it haven't checked any of that stuff out just been major busy on my end um, so I would have to check all that stuff out um, but yeah I missed that sh uh, streaming just had to tell them in advance so it wasn't like last second um it was about a couple hours beforehand so just um but yeah i was at my sister's on the day we didn't get back to about nine eight or nine at night so yeah it was a crazy one that one and then we're up there this weekend again on sunday for her birthday i'll be make sure to bring some cupcakes over for little madam <laughs> So um, yeah, it was, uh, it's going to be a really nice time, and uh, it's just always nice to spend those uh, sort of uh, times in life. Um, but I think for Saturday it should be fine though, because Saturday I'm hoping will be alright. So if if I can, I'll get a stream done for Saturday, um, and I'll see what time's best. Definitely let me know what time works best. Just to the same time, and um, yeah, just uh, definitely let me know guys um, I wouldn't mind doing that um, but I will see but I'm going to end the stream there though guys but thank thank you to everyone that's the chat by thank you to the support uh, from Josh and Megan it really does help me grow all uh, my streams and all of the stuff I do so cheers for the support guys um, and I hope to see you guys in the next stream. That will be Chaos Theory Friday. Um, so it will be the same time. Um, I'll have to see what, uh, how long each one is. It's most of the time it is three hours. So I might just max it out to three hours. And then just keep it to that. But um, yeah, um, I'll just be doing some trophy hunting on this one. And yeah, uh, but until until next until next time guys. Thank you. Thank you to all of the people that have came in to support my stream. And until until next time, guys, thank you very much, guys. And I will see you all Friday at noon. Thank, thanks, guys. Bye.